quick to make and delicious to have. Here is my recipe on how to make ginger and scallion chicken. For this recipe, I'm using half a chicken, that's about 800 grams. Marinate this with 3 tablespoons of light soya sauce, 1 tablespoon of dark cooking caramel, and a teaspoon of sesame oil. Add one and a half teaspoons of salt, one teaspoon of brown sugar. Now mix all this thoroughly and leave it to marinate for 20 minutes. Now slice one inch ginger really thin. About four spring onions, but only use the bottom hard part. Chop the green parts roughly and keep it aside for later. Heat up a wok and pour in 4 tablespoons of cooking oil. I'm using peanut oil for its fragrance. To this, add your sliced ginger and stir it well. Let it fry till the ginger turns slightly brown. You will notice a beautiful aroma coming out. Now add the bottom part of the spring onion. Let these two ingredients simmer and sizzle, allowing all their aroma and flavour to come out. Once the spring onion turns slightly brown, it's time to add in the marinated chicken. Now give this a good stir until all the ingredients are well mixed. You want to keep frying till the chicken turns light brown. Don't add any water, just continue to fry with the aromatics. If the chicken starts caramelizing, you can add a little bit of water just to scrape the bottom up. And then continue frying the chicken in this liquid. When the chicken has started turning light brown, you can now add one cup of chicken stock. If you don't have stock, you can always use water. Now mix this and let it cook for a good 10 to 15 minutes. Stir it occasionally so that the bottom doesn't burn. Now add in the green parts of the spring onion and stir for 1 to 2 minutes. To this add a mixture of 1 teaspoon of corn flour with 3 tablespoons of water to thicken the gravy. Stir it in quickly before it thickens too much and turn off the stove. Serve your dish with thinly cut spring onions and thinly cut ginger. It's all ready for makan now. Now it's time to dig into this yumminess. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe. This recipe is brought to you by Hearty Meals Home Cooked Vegan